Eight to two one. Okay, your winner goes off at eight to one, as Frank mentioned. It's five four line. here. So eight to one, six to one. Breaking news though, Giacomo is back from Maryland, back from the Preakness. The Kentucky Derby winner returns to Hollywood Park. Ken Rudolph is with him. There he is in all of his glory. The Kentucky Derby winner. <laughs> My adopted boy. Giacomo, we're about to make television history, the first ever interview with a Kentucky Derby winner. So, do you remember that time when you were behind all those horses, and then you were running, and then you're weaving in out of traffic, and then you got to the outside? Do you remember that? Yeah, that was cool, wasn't it? And then you remember that time when Mike Smith was whipping you with the right hand, and then you responded? Yeah, he remembers that too. You are <laughs> the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. You are my boy forever. I don't care what anybody says. Just came fresh off the plane from his third place finish in the 130th running of the Preakness. The only one running against the bias, might I add. Speed favoring track that day, but he doesn't care. And you can tell he's, uh, he's pretty famished. So the question now is what's next for this Big old stud. Look at you. Look at you. Who's a pretty one? You are. And you got more heart than they give you credit for, brother. That's right. Only question now is what's next for your Kentucky Derby winner at 50 to 1? Will he go in the Belmont at a mile and a half and take on a Fleet Alex in the rubber match of the Triple Crown Series? Only time will tell. But the patient man over there in the corner, John Sheriffs, will make the right decision. And the good news is our California boy is back. Giacomo. Back home. Reston, looking good. Guys, back to you on the set. <coughs> Ken Rudolph, you never cease to amaze yeah. me. Outstanding. Uh, getting to the yeah. backside there to greet you.